Hi, thanks for joining me. So, here I'm going to cover how to remove a high pressure oil pump from a 7.3 liter power stroke. This is actually uh, from behind the uh, engine, so you can get a better view of what you're working with here. On the back side here, we've got two 10 millimeter bolts to remove. They're located right here and right here under where the fuel pr or the where the oil pressure regulator was. Remove the oil lines here. It's 18 millimeter. There we go. Of course now it probably would have made matters simpler to taking the sensor here off the uh, reservoir. But before you take the uh, bolts off the back of the pump, let's go here to the front of the pump. You'll want to uh, get in here to this cover. And behind here is the uh, gear that connects the pump to the uh, cam. But the bolt that you'll need to take off is under this cover right here. First, let's get the water pump out of the way. There we go. It's actually not necessary to do that. I'd already done this taking the water pump off. <clears throat> but anyway, you'll need an 8mm socket. Take these bolts off. Now in my case with the engine out, I gotta clamp the crank there. <coughs> but anyway, to get this bolt here out that holds the pump on, or that holds the gear on the pump that drives it, I'm gonna need an 18 millimeter socket. Takes a little effort once you get that off there. Just and what you want to make sure not to do is, you see, there's a washer on that bolt. You don't want that dropped in your block. Okay. So that takes care of that for this side of the engine. There's two bolts. Two 10 millimeter bolts that hold your pump onto the reservoir. One's right here. The other one is right there next to where the IPR valve is. Not the closest one, but the farthest one.
And there you are. That's how you remove a high pressure oil pump. To put it on, same reverse order. Just want to make sure that you get this gasket here on. Really good. And I mean really good. And that's what it looks like. And that right there, it's just a, that's actually a gear.